recent years, many of us have delved into our family histories, but few stories are as compelling as that of Yeshikasa and her great-grandfather. But your grandpa? My grandfather was an emperor, yes. He was quite aware that Mussolini, the Italian leader, had his eyes on Ethiopia. It was his intention to make Ethiopia an extension of Italy. Yeah. Emperor Selassie I, being aware that he was no match for an invading Italian army, had to come up with another means of maintaining the sovereignty of his dear country, Ethiopia. In 1935, Mussolini, ignoring the non-aggression policy of the Leagues of Nations, invaded Ethiopia, took control of Ethiopia's capital, Addis Ababa, and forced Emperor Selassie I into exile. Until the philosophy which holds one race superior and another inferior is finally and permanently discredited and abandoned, until there are no longer first-class and second-class citizens of any nature, that until the color of a man's skin is of no more significance than the color of his eyes, that until the basic human rights are equally guaranteed to all without regard to race, no morality will remain but a fleeting illusion to be pursued but never attained. Until the philosophy which old one race superior and another inferior is finally and permanently discredited and abandoned and until there's no longer first class nor second class citizens of any nation until the color of a man's skin is of no more significance to the color of his eyes of and until the basic human rights are equally guaranteed to all without regard to race Cause until that day The dream of lasting peace World citizenship And the rule of international morality Will remain in